Hey, how's it going everyone? Thanks for joining me on another adventure. I'm out with my uh, best companion, Murdoch. We're going to be doing some hot tenting. Uh, it's been a while, unfortunately. I've been busy with other things, but uh, finally getting back out here. As you can see, it's uh, dark out. We're getting a late start. You know, it's Friday night after work. Andy is also going to be joining us, but he is not here yet, so he's getting an even later start. Uh, but he'll be here soon. But anyway, since it is dark and the lighting's poor, I'm going to just go ahead and get everything set up and check back in with you soon. I'm also trying out some new gear this weekend. One of the things is a bunk bed cot, which I'm pretty excited about. I'm going to be having uh, Murdoch uh, testing it out with me. He'll be on the bottom bunk and I'll be on the top bunk. So stick around for that and a few other new pieces of gear. Okay, well we got uh, camp set up for the most part. Uh, still waiting on Andy. Uh, he's been working long hours lately. Um, unfortunately, the bunk bed, <laughs> this tent's just not quite big enough to allow the height. So we won't be testing that out, which is a shame. I'll have to get a bigger tent for that, but it's a shame because I wanted to use that to be able to take my kids hot tenting uh, sometime here soon. It looks like I'll be needing a bigger tent first. No big deal, we'll get that situated. Anyways, um, we're gonna get a fire going while we wait, wait for Andy. I'm trying out something different this time instead of normal wood. Got these uh, bio blocks, it's like compressed sawdust. Um, I've heard other people having good luck with it, so we're gonna give that a try. As per tradition, we are using some fat wood to help get the fire started. All right, new piece of gear we're using today. I'm pretty excited about it. It's a new ferro rod I have. And the reason why I'm excited about it is because it's actually an idea I had a while ago and been waiting for someone to make one. Um, if anyone's familiar with the old rope style lighters, uh, I believe sailors and stuff like that used to use them because for windy conditions. Um, essentially you have a rope going through a uh, metal housing with a uh, flint. You pre-char the end of the, the rope so that way it takes a uh, spark easily. It doesn't actually light up and flame up but it um, it creates a, a little ember uh, so that way you can light your cigarettes in the wind. Well this is similar to that except it's got a ferro rod instead of a, a flint striker. And then instead of just any old rope, it actually has this wax infused or oil infused, something like that, uh, hemp rope. That you um, light instead. So essentially what I'll do is get this on fire, get the rope on fire, and then just stick that in and light the uh, fat wood. So and it comes with a uh, striker it's also good for for fraying the end of your rope so that way it takes a spark easier and and what 
is nifty about it is that when you're done to put it out, you pull this back inside this aluminum housing and it snuffs it out. Ready to be used the next time. Lights up really quick and easy as you can see. And it gets a really good flame going. Depending on how much rope you have out, you can make it larger or smaller. And out it goes. Just like that. So, yeah, I like it. It's really slick. Makes starting fires really easy. All right, Andy's made it finally. Like I said, we both got a late start today. But uh, he's getting his tent set up here. And then we're going to get cooking. So, uh, yeah, we'll check back in. Okay. Finally, we're getting around to dinner. It's late. Uh, what is it? Probably 10.30 or something? It's probably pushing 11 now. Pushing 11 now. So, not too horribly late. We've done worse before. Done later. So, what are we having, Andy? Steak fajitas. Steak fajitas. Sounds yes. delicious. Oh, I'm definitely hungry. Yeah, me too. We both forgot butter. <laughs> so... <laughs> But uh, we're going to use the fat from our steak to grease the pan. Alright, got that greased up with the fat. And uh, get it all going here. That did not have an impressive scissor. Yeah, uh, it was not. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry to disappoint. You are such no <laughs> such a disappointment, Andy. No. Mm. I've heard that before. I feel like. <laughs> God, it smells good though. It smells real good. We haven't even done anything yet. Oh, just those onions and peppers and and heating up the fat. Yeah, that's true. First bite. Just weird. Andy's diving in. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's have some reactionary description flavors building and cresting. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you what do you taste? Notes of notes of beef. Beef. Cheese. <laughs> Delicious. We're gonna eat now. Well, Andy's in his tent now. I'm just enjoying, enjoying the warmth of the fire for a little bit before I go to bed. Gotta try and get Murdoch off my bed. Try to get him off of it earlier. He was not going. So, hopefully I'm not sleeping on the ground tonight. Well, anyways, I'm just gonna sit here a little bit longer before uh, getting, getting in bed, like I said. And, uh, yeah, I'll check with you guys in the morning. Good morning. Had a wonderful night. Slept great. So did Murdoch. I'm Murdoch. Just say hi. Hi. Can you wave at the camera? No. <laughs> Got pretty cold. Not like super cold. I think in the teens. But uh, we stayed nice and toasty. It's always nice to take it slow in the morning when you're hot tenting. Just sit back and enjoy the fire for a little bit. It's snowing. I believe it's supposed to snow pretty much all day. There's Andy's tent. There's Murdoch. And his astronaut suit. Alright, well that's gonna do it for this trip. We uh, had a late start. 
hung out most of the day, um, but unfortunately we have busy lives, so we are unable to make it a longer trip. So, uh, hope everyone enjoyed it. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Uh, sorry it's such a quick video, but better than nothing. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. I like and subscribe. Like, like, and subscribe, Elvin idiot. Like, like, and subscribe. Like, like, and subscribe. Like, like, and subscribe. Oh, I'm pointing at you. Like, like, and subscribe. One more time. Like, like, and subscribe. Nope, still didn't get it. Okay. Like, like, <laughs> and then subscribe.